China is upping its tourism marketing to appeal to New Yorkers. China's tourism board has launched a new campaign to entice more Americans to make the journey. CCTV's Tracy Tandon has the story. Visit Beijing, a travel documentary produced by Beijing's municipal government that aired on local TV here in New York. It's the latest effort by Chinese tourism officials to make Beijing an appealing holiday destination. In a 2013 tourism competitiveness report compiled by the World Economic Forum, China ranked 45th among 140 countries. Experts say China must step up its marketing strategy in order to compete with neighboring countries. It takes a lot of marketing dollars, a lot of promotion to uh, attract that same visitor. And if you look around the globe and you look at all the work that's being done to attract the same tourist, it's significant. People are spending money, they're in the market, they are um, working on the ease of entry. So it's, it's, it's a lot of work and it takes several years to, to cultivate. According to China's National Tourism Administration, a little more than two million Americans visited China in 2013. Research firm Euromonitor says factors such as air pollution, crowded hotels and a stronger currency have diminished China's attractiveness as a tourist hotspot. Recent changes to travel visas between the U.S. and China, including extended validity from one year to ten years, are expected to lure more Americans to Beijing. But distance will always be an issue. I think the long-haul flights probably do come into consideration uh, when Americans are looking to travel. They may be looking at a convenient destination that they can get to, get on a beach in a few hours, uh, go to an exotic destination. Some of the urban areas that are very, very far away, they may think twice about. With initiatives like the documentary Visit Beijing and extensions to travel visas, China is hoping it's enough to lure Americans out of the Big Apple and into the Forbidden City. Tracy Tandon, CCTV, New York.